Norway, a Scandinavian country, is one of the most gorgeous countries in the world, which is in the bucket list of every travel enthusiast. Starting from the nation's awe-striking landscape to the natural wonders like the polar sun and northern lights, the country Norway is an incredible and worthy place to visit. Here is a travel guide to two of the most scenic places of Norway, Oslo and Tromsø, from where you can enjoy the spectacular beauty of northern lights. The visa. All Indian passport holders need visitors visa to visit Norway which you can apply online or if you are planning to visit several Schengen countries at a time then you can apply for a Schengen visa I will provide the visa application link in the description box below The flight You can get flights to the Norway capital Oslo from New Delhi which generally include one to two in between stops The travel guide Day 1 Here we suggest you to start the tour from Oslo. Oslo is a beautiful as well as one of the largest capitals of the world in terms of area. Despite being renowned as an exotic skiing destination and home to tons of great museums, the vast land of the city is still filled with parks, protected forests, hills and hundreds of lakes. Due to this interesting feature of the city, exploring Oslo tourist places is always exciting. Day 2 On the second day of the tour, go for a city sightseeing Oslo hop on hop off tour. This sightseeing tour will cover almost all the major tourist attractions of the city. The first place to visit is the Vigeland Sculpture Park. It is the most popular tourist attraction of Oslo. This unique sculpture park contains life work of Gustav Vigeland, 650 of his dynamic sculptures in bronze, granite and wrought iron are here. You can also find the Oslo City Museum and the Vigeland Museum just outside the park. Next important place that you must visit will be Norsk Folk Museum. It is an open air museum that houses permanent exhibits of Norwegian folk culture of 500 years. The buildings of the museums are divided into different areas that highlight various time periods and settings. After that you can visit the ski museum. It is one of the oldest ski museum of the world. If you are a ski enthusiast then you will find here exhibits that tell you the story of nearly 4000 years of ski history. Your Oslo tour will be incomplete if you don't take a boat ride of Oslo Fjord. The fjord connects Oslo city to North Sea. There are several boat tour options available with full amenities. Rising from the Oslo Fjord, there are the majestic fortress of Akershus. You can easily spend some time in the museum of this fortress on your day tour. Day 3. On the third day, go to Tromsø from Oslo. You will get flight from Oslo to Tromsø. Tromsø is the northern Norway's largest city that lies between Narvik and Hammerfest on a small island. Established in the 13th century, it is a major fishing port of the country. The city is famous for the awe-striking view of northern lights as well as the midnight sun. No tour to Tromsø will be complete unless you see the northern lights. This is one of the seven wonders of the world. Late September to early March is the best time to witness this unique feature. A good place to have a great view of the northern lights is from Sturstein. You can avail a ride of Flenhesen cable car to reach there in the enclosed gondola and watch the lights and the town below from the viewing platform. Day 4. On the fourth day, you can explore some great places of Tromsø like Arctic Alpine Botanic Garden. It is the world's northernmost botanic garden divided into 25 collections area. Each of the collections here showcases a different cold weather species or region like the plants of the Himalayas, the Arctic, the plants from other extreme weathers and traditional Norwegian plants. A cruise tour to explore the fjords near the coast of the Norwegian Sea is a must do activity while you are in Tromsø. One of the best fjords near Tromsø is Linjen Fjord, an 82 km long passage by the Linjen Alps and a popular place for witnessing northern lights. Another exciting activity that you can enjoy here is dog sledging. It is synonymous with the arctic life now and has become a popular activity for tourists. Day 
On the fifth day, head back to the airport for departure. Other details In Norway, you will find hotels and restaurants of different budget ranges. Starting from a hostel or budget hotel, you can easily get a luxury hotel here. For Oslo, you can avail a city hop-on hop-off tour to cover all the major tourist places. Also, to minimize your budget for admission fees and transportation, you can purchase a visit Oslo Pass. All of the bookings can be done online. I will provide the online booking links in the description box below. If you love this travel guide, then please like and share the video. Also, do let us know your opinion in the comment section below. Your opinion means a lot to us. Thanks for watching it.